Day 35, quarantine, and we need some dessert. We did no baking today, but we're going to make popcorn. We have this machine, this uh, stovetop cooker. It's called a Whirly Pot, and I got it for Christmas. And see, it has a turning thing on the bottom. This is how you make um, caramel and kettle corn. So what we're going to do first is make a plain popcorn, and it takes a half a cup of corn kernels. So come kind of already put one fourth. So let's put the other fourth. That makes how many? One fourth and one fourth makes one half. Okay, put it in. All right. Now we're going to turn our fire on. Let's turn the fire on. Okay, he's got the fire on. We're going to put a rolly pop, and this will only take a few minutes. This is an amazing pot. I'm the popcorn queen, and I love my whirly pop. Do you see the spinner? It What it does, it spins. Our next batch, we're going to put sugar in. We're going to make one batch plain, and next batch, we'll have white sugar for kettle corn, and the third batch will be brown sugar for caramel corn. So that's why you really like the spinner. So we melted some butter. And he's going to sprinkle some butter. And then after you sprinkle your butter, what are you going to do next? You're going to sprinkle salt. Sprinkle salt. Mm -hmm. This is our first round of plain butter salted popcorn. You got to watch Kamakana because he loved the salt. Okay, we made the regular popcorn with salt and butter. Now we're going to make kettle corn. So we got half a cup of popcorn with some oil. And then what are we going to put in? One, three-fourths cup of white sugar. Okay, we're going to put the lid on, and then the spinning thing is going to um, make it so it doesn't burn. This is what it's kind of getting um, with the white sugar, what it looks like. Do you see why it's nice to have that spinner on the bottom? If you did it in a regular pot, you would have to really shake it, and it ends up burning. But that bottom spinner makes you able to make, um, make um, sugar corn, like kettle corn and caramel corn. Okay, we made our kettle corn with white sugar. We made the plain regular one. Now we're going to make a caramel. So we're going to put three-fourths cup of brown sugar. And we're going to cook it. And we'll be back. 